Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be such a fun one and I'm super excited. We're gonna do a few Halloween DIYs to just spooky my home up just a little bit for this Halloween season. So the first one, we're gonna DIY some pumpkins. Um, I picked up pumpkins. The best place to grab pumpkins, I think, is Aldi, but they don't have the different colors. So if you're looking for basic orange, it was like, under it was three dollars for a huge pumpkin i'll show you guys they're outside and then i got the white one from walmart and their prices are pretty good as well you're gonna get pumpkins under five dollars but i also picked up this little artist kit and we're gonna go outside and zhuzh up these pumpkins just a little bit to make them a little bit fun and exciting for this halloween season pumpkin here from Aldi it was just three dollars and then this one was four dollars from Walmart So guys, we are done. I think it came out so cute. And I did the half on that one, but yeah, I think it came out really cute. And besides waiting for paint to dry, I feel like it took me like 20 minutes. Like really short, and they're so cute and adorable and really affordable. 
So if you already have paint, which a lot of people do, then you could just use what you have, but that pumpkin was only $3 and it's just some paint. And then this pumpkin, and then I only used a paintbrush on one part, but you don't even need to lose a paintbrush. You could just use your Sharpie and this pen that you have in your house. So it only costs as much as pretty much the pumpkin. So very cheap. Hi guys, it is day two and I am working on the second DIY project. Um, it is much later on in the day, so I don't know. Today I didn't even get ready, but that's okay. Um, we're, I'm gonna show you guys what I have. I'm watching a little Heart of Dixie, but I have to leave probably in the next hour to go pick up Brooklyn. So hopefully I can get this done and then I have more poster board. Hopefully I can get some of the bats traced, but let me flip you. So yeah, I am watching Heart of Dixie. I've seen this series before, but I just love it so much. And yeah, I know how in the fall, some people watch Gilmore Girls. I watch Heart of Dixie. All right, guys, I have you on the tripod, but this one I would say um, is another inexpensive one. We're gonna try to make a ghost. Um, I have the tomato cage. This is about like two bucks. Um, this is probably, this is the most expensive thing of this project. This was $12. We have some fabric. I got like the spare fabric at Walmart. This is only $4. And then I picked up some felt, but you can use whatever you have and some new lights, but you can use lights that you have. I just picked up these from Walmart. I thought that I would, um, use them during like Christmas time. They were actually in the Christmas section because all of like the Halloween lights had color to it. Sorry in the background, I have my washing machine on. I'm doing so much laundry today. I've been doing like laundry, cleaning, tidying, all that stuff. Um, but yeah, so picked up these and let's get started. Um, I'm gonna use a hair tie to put it together. And then let me check these lights to see if I need to put in a battery because I hope I have the battery. I probably do. Um, I have this little nifty. I do. I need three double A's. So let me go grab those to make sure these work really good. Okay, I got this. Do we think eyes or no eyes? Eyes. Do eyes. Let me put a little piece of tape. Okay, let's see. Eyes. I just put tape so we can see. What do we think? Eyes or no eyes? We have eyes. That's everything. I think I like the witch's hat on. I kind of think no eyes. Ooh. And the witch's hat. I kind of like it like that, guys. Yeah.
there are the bats. And then I think we're gonna put um, on the reef, we'll probably put like spider webs and like spiders on there and probably kind of put spiders and spider webs on all of this, but I like it. Very cute and simple. Do the quick recap. The bat DIY is could be practically free. I paid 70 cents for the paper, so that's all I spent on that one. The ghost probably was the most expensive. The hat is actually from Brooklyn's play area. The sheet is, or the fabric, that was um, from Walmart. It was only four something. The tomato wire inside was $2.79 from Lowe's. The lights were from Walmart. They were seven something, but if you have lights at home, that part would be free as well. And then I just used a foam ball and that was the most expensive item coming in at $12.98. And then the pumpkins, another super inexpensive activity. If you have paint already, then it's not gonna cost you anything. I bought a paint kit that came with paint brushes and like eight or nine paints. And that um, came in at like five bucks. And then this pumpkin, the big one, orange one, like I said, is from Aldi. And then the other one is from Walmart. And that was $4, so super inexpensive, but I think they have a great, fun impact. Mm -hmm.